Now at 5.30, this story. I was a little startled. Um, you know, you've seen stories in the news about weird things washing up on the beach. <laughs> it is a mystery on the Connecticut shoreline that's getting a lot of attention. What exactly is this thing on the beach? It's got some choppers. Yeah, we posted the pictures on our Facebook page and shared them more than 500 times, and hundreds of you commented about what this might be. Well, Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Kevin Hogan is live tonight with the mobile newsroom in Old Lyme to help solve this monster mystery. Hi, Kevin. Hi, we may never know, Mark and Denise, but the DEP says they don't really sure, very sure as to exactly what it is because it's gone. Uh, but uh, Ryan Lee, who stumbled across this animal carcass on the beach on Monday, says he called it the Montauk Monster because back in 2008, a carcass of an animal washed up on the beach in Montauk, New York. This carcass of an animal washed up onto Miami Beach following Sunday storm and high tides. The guy who took these pictures, Ryan Lee, couldn't figure out what it was, so he posted them online where more than a quarter million people have viewed it. I, I don't know what kind of animal it is. I, I contacted uh, Public Works to see if they could uh, come remove it because obviously it's don't want that decaying on the beach. Guesses include a skunk, a small bear, a fisher cat, even a badger. I don't know what it is. People all over Facebook are finding all kinds of ideas that, you know, funny things it might be and whatever, but who knows. The state DEP tells Eyewitness News their experts confirm it's a mammal and not a sea creature, probably a skunk. The local public works crew already took the Montauk monster away for good. I mean, with, uh, you know, the way the tides are and uh, some of the flooding, you know, something could have got, you know, washed out of the Connecticut River and then ended up here. Or, you know, something could have got, you know, pulled from inland with, you know, high tide surge. Well, Old Line Public Works is pretty sure it's a skunk. They got rid of it, so we'll never know. Live though, Mobile Newsroom in Old Line, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.